What's up everybody and welcome to my legendary weapon guide for the Firestorm. Now, the Firestorm is one of the three new legendaries brought in to Borderlands 2 from Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon's Keep. Uh, the other two being the Ogre and the Chain Lightning, which I've not done yet, but the Ogre I have done. Now, the Firestorm is basically, in my opinion, the strongest of all the all the spells in in terms of damage it does more than the chain lightning and it definitely does more than the unique versions and the magic missile but uh anyway with with this if you want to go for this uh there are multiple ways to farm for this but you're going to want to go for the the wizards now what i've heard is that the of all the wizards the fire mage or whatever the any you know any fire type of ultimate badass with oh, they have to be ultimate badass badass by the way Ultimate Badass Wizards. The Fire type, from what I heard, has like a higher chance to drop it, but you know, um, that's just what I heard. Uh, and here I get one to drop, as you saw, I killed that fired one, and you could sort of see it right there, see it? It's over by the, you could sort of see the orange light coming up by the, the green ammo shrine or whatever. And I'm like, this is when I first went for the ogre, and I was like, oh, oh. I was this duke of orc was giving me such a bad time that I didn't even notice it. And I'm going to walk right past it, too. You're about to see. But yeah, th there are multiple places to farm this. Uh, badass round in the magical slaughter, that works. The altar, I think you could use that to summon badasses or whatever. There's, there's plenty of places. But as you can see, see it's right there? And I look at the fireball, and then I run past it. It's like, what? And I'm like, wait. What's this? And I'm like, oh, nice. And I can't pick it up and, ins and inspect it because I'm in co-op. But that's okay. Now, um, the special effect of this gun, it looks like the fireball. You throw it, and it's a fireball, and it explodes on contact into fire. But this one, if as you saw there a second ago, like, look, I'll, I'll see. See the fireballs raining down from the sky. It's like Armageddon in your hand. It's like, whoop, whoop, whoop. see, I'm going to try and, uh, I know in this video you'll be able to see them like spawning in up there. They just like appear, like they teleport in from like ores. And they see, do you see that? Yeah, these these are really cool. And with the Gunzerker, you could throw twos, and you just spam grenades. Same with Axton, spam grenades. And with Krieg, you could use Hellborn to really boost the fire. But yeah, this is a rather good grenade mod. I rather enjoy it. Definitely like it better than Chain Lightning. Now, um. Oh, a reference to the flavor text. This is pretty cool, I guess, if you get it. I definitely don't get it, but that's okay. Um, it's a reference to Tim the Enchanter from Monty Python and the Holy Grail. And King Heart and um, King Arthur, he asked Monty, the, the, the flavor text, What manner of man are you that can summon up fire without flint or tinder? Uh, I've, I never saw Monty Python and the Holy Grail or whatever. I know all about King Arthur and stuff, but, you know. That's, that's uh, I guess, a cool reference. You may find that pretty cool. But, <laughs> now let's get let's just get on to the grenade itself. This all-around good grenade, like all the spells, it will regenerate your ammo slowly over time. Well, well your grenade ammo. Let's not get that mixed up. It'll slowly regenerate grenade ammo. It's not very fast. I'd say it's, I don't know, about 30 seconds, maybe 30, 40 seconds it'll... Regenerate a grenade, which isn't bad. It's not bad. You're definitely not going to be able to spam grenades and just, like, throw them out, like, as many as you can. But you will always have, like, a few grenades on you. And it's pretty well, like, an invincible fight if you want to, like, use, like, have something to throw and while the rubies in your hand to get your health back real quick. You'll always have the grenades on pretty much throughout the entire fight. At least that's what, you know, works for me. Now, like... I'm sure a ton of you know this, but the re the reason they regenerate is sort of like uh, a mana if you're in a video game. Like, let's say you're in like League of Legends or, st or something, and you got mana, whatever. And it's like, you know how it like slowly, slowly regenerates over time? That's basically what these grenades are. It's it's the same concept. Now, in here, I, uh, I show you the damage, but it's kind of hard to show you it. And I'm surprised the fireballs aren't like coming out at me. Oh, they did hit me. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> anyway, I go outside and I uh, I show you like them spawning in from the sky. It's really cool. This is a really cool grenade. I recommend going for it. It's pretty good. 
Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. If you want to know where to find it, there are plenty of videos out on YouTube. Uh, I don't have a video on it, but I know there's plenty of people who do, so. Uh, good luck getting this grenade, and I'll see you guys later.